Hey y'all, it's April 8th, Eclipse Day. What are you guys going to do? What are your plans? I was going to do a live right now, but I can't get any internet service at all. Can't get any connection at all. And it's what, 1030? About 1030 in the morning here. And I'm looking at the sun, it's high, but when I first got here this morning, as a matter of fact, I'm at the greenhouse right now, which is, you know, several miles away from where I actually live. So when I first got here, I looked up at the sun as the sun was coming up, and already tic-tac-toe all across the sky in front of the sun. Again, Monica's like, why? Why are they doing that? And especially today, normally you see the tic-tac-toe later on in the day when the sun is setting, come to think of it. But this is the first time I have pretty much at sunrise, I'm seeing the tic-tac-toes in front of the sun as the sun is coming up. So that's significant that, that, I, that I was able to perceive that that's different right now. But um, what my plans are is I'm at the greenhouse right now because all my babies are in there. I, I have to tell you guys that too. I'll, I'll, I'll put a little video clip of, of my the greenhouse that I'm running now. I'm so excited about it. But I uh, already have my routine set up for Eclipse Day. I had already said that I was not going to be working today, but I, I have to be here for right now. But my plan is to go home. I'm about to leave now and go home. And I have my, I'm gonna, I have my setup. Um, of how I'm going to have things for my um, my own eclipse moment. That's the only thing that I can call it. Some people are saying, go in your house, close the shutters, don't look at it, it, uh, it it's the devil, or something like that. And others are saying, no, it's something about the black sun and the indigenous people of this earth. will be able to, not will be able to, but no denying it. This energy that is coming is going to break that DNA hold that possibly may be on some of us and unlock that DNA and we become those original beings again. I hope that's the case. I hope that's the case. And maybe that's why they're fighting so hard, because they know something's about to pop off. So my plan is I am going to, my decision is I'm going to go back home, and I'm going to set me my own, like, pad on the ground. And I am just going, I'm, and actually I have my, uh, what do you call that? It's, it's a welder's, welder's lens, you know, that goes on a welding glasses like that. Because I, I'm, 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 I'm undecided about whether to look directly at the eclipse or view it with both. So what I've decided to do is I'm going to do both. <laughs> I want to view it with the, uh, with the lens. So I can really stare at it, and then I'm going to take it off and just stare. My choice. If that's what resonates with me. So that's what I'm going to do. And I want to be on the ground, laying flat on my back with my crystals. Uh, I'll have my sage with me. And it's just going to be me. Mother Earth. And this energy that is coming from above, that I believe with every fiber of my being, is that divine, creative source. And if this is the time that Creator has decided, this is it, so be it. If not, we just move on, keep rolling. So I just wanted to share that with you, what my thoughts were about what I'm going to do for the eclipse. Now, after the 
after the eclipse, and it's only supposed to last from, I think it's 1.53 to 2.03 here. And what they're saying is that if it extends past that time, that's a signal that we've gone into the three days of darkness. And that's when they say everyone is supposed to stay in your homes, and whoever's in your home stays in your home. And when you leave the house, you ain't coming back. And anyone that comes to your door wanting entrance into your home after the three days of darkness has started, um, the consensus is saying, uh-uh. And I'm at that mind frame, too. So if something does, if, if it extends past the, the time, I'm going into my cabin, and I'm staying there. And I'm staying there, and I'm staying there. Are you ready? You got some food, you got some water, and even our government and, 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 and the folks that are supposed to be watching out for us, they're telling us, Get food, get water, get medical supplies, have it in your home. So just pay attention. Again, no fear, because whatever's going to happen is going to happen. And when it, when it happens, it's going to be at that divine time that creator source has already designated, that no one knows except that creative source, not even us being facets of source. We're not privy to that information. So be prepared, not scared. Remember who and what we are. We are sovereign, free, spirit beings. No fear. And as always, baby, Keep your vibrations high. I'll see y'all after the eclipse. <laughs>